All right, guys. Hey there. OFD checking in here. And today we're going to have a really quick unboxing of a watch that I kind of didn't expect to buy. But after watching a number of videos from other channels and stuff like that, I kind of decided that this watch was something I kind of wanted to have in the collection. And so I ordered one up. I had a coupon. So this watch actually cost me right around $50. And uh, which is kind of amazing for what you get. Actually, the retail price of this watch is $99. And I think that what you get for $99 is pretty doggone good. So I'm going to stop talking. I'm going to go ahead and open this thing up. So I'm sure if you guys are watching watch videos out there, you recognize this name. And yeah, I know that a lot of people have looked at these Phoebus or Phoebus or I don't know how you want to pronounce it. Forgive me for mutilating the name of this watch. But pretty cool offering so like i said standard retail on this watch is 99 dollars. now this is the quartz model of their 300 meter diver watch um, basically a submariner homage but what i'm going to call a steinhardt ocean one homage because it really really reminds me of that and i think everyone else out there has kind of talked about that so as you guys can see comes in a nice box here if you guys watch the videos very well done very nice snap closure on the front. Whoops, paperwork slides out very simply like that. You have your one year international warranty for their quartz watches. Very nice, very well done. Um, don't really expect stuff like this on a $100 watch. Nice paperwork like this. Um, yeah, very nice. Water Waterproof rating information. Pretty much everything you need to operate your new quartz watch from Phoebus or Phoebus, however you want to say that. So all their paperwork there, but who cares? Let's get into this watch. Now, like I said, guys, this is a $99 watch at retail price. Now, let's go ahead and be patient here, Mr. Dunlap, so this will focus. There it goes. So $99 retail. This watch incorporates sapphire crystal, screw down crown, 300 meter rating, this is a complete solid uh, link bracelet, including solid in links on it. 120 click unidirectional bezel, which actually feels very good and has almost no back play. Does remind me a lot. I had a, uh, a Steinhardt Ocean one, the GMT, and uh, this does actually remind me quite a bit of it as far as the heft and everything like that goes. Really quick like, we'll take it off of the bracelet. Guys, I'm not going to do a full, like, real review of this watch just because uh, I don't know it that much yet. It just showed up today. This is running a Ronda 515 quartz movement. Three-year battery life on this movement. Nice case polishing. Great uh, Phoebus logo case back there, as you guys can see. A little bit. Like I said, solid in-links. That's crazy at this price point and $99. And to have solid links on this bracelet blows me away. As well as a sapphire crystal with a actual magnifying cyclops. Pretty impressive. Um, pretty impressive. So what I'm going to do, though, guys, is I'm going to wear this watch for like a week. Uh, probably even more than that. I'm going to wear it till I'm done doing this, this work project I'm working on right now, which is going to involve a lot of mountain work, a lot of hiking, a lot of banging around and stuff like that. I'll try to wear it as much as I can on this bracelet, but I will probably stick it on a NATO strap at times just because I'm not honestly much of a bracelet guy, but I'll go ahead and give the bracelet some good testing and bang it up a little bit to make sure it works. And then I'll, uh, yeah, I'll report back to you kind of at the end of uh, a month or so of working with this watch. And, uh, you know, let's see if we can bang it up a little bit, give it some patina, make it look good. And, uh, then I'll talk about it. I'll let you know more about it. But right now, initial impressions um, for $99. Wow. I mean, I, I can't think of another watch out there that you can buy that has this, this kind of heft. Um, and, of course, the provenance of a, uh, you know, the Submariner-looking watch, which, uh, yeah, it's kind of copied so much nowadays. I don't know. Um it's just kind of a sub watch, I guess a sub style watch. So very cool. Uh, I will get back to you guys on this uh, Phoebus 300 meter professional diver here in the near future after I give it some good testing out in the field and see how it works out. 
So, all right, guys, if you like this video, go ahead and give me a thumbs up down there at the bottom. And if you've not subscribed to the OFD channel yet, please do. Please do. All right, guys, thanks.